Where am I now? What day is it? Oh, cartmel. Here we go. Here we go. Cartmel next. <laughs> this is the Starter's Orders hurdle. Next, this is leg two, I think, of the Starter's Orders series. And this is the track with the extremely long running where they don't go past the stand until the end. And it's a two mile seven furlong, 0 to 120. And the top one is Billy Roden Tapper for Thomas Rogers. Karma Rouge Island for Alex Cherry was a winner first time out. Pedro Aguirre Cheda or Cheda for Darren Thompson. Heartbreak Hotel for Paul Rhodes. Mercury Rising Craig Beck with Clifton Hassel for Ryan Costello. Cuddly Cord Grand Plutabook. Return of the Ghost Joshua Sutherland. Scenario Woodfire Thomas Rogers. Hyacinth Calapa Darren Thompson. Latent Damage Daniel French. Brilliant Melody Alex Cherry. Woodlass Drummer James Shea and Cirque for Martin Leadham. So 14 then in this interesting race if you've not seen a race at Cartmel before it's all good fun and away they go as you can see this they come past the this bit here and that home straight there they go round and round and round they don't go down that until the end so all the people in the stand don't get to see the horses until the end of the race it's a very strange setup uh, they come past the uh oh, furlong mark there and get to the first of the 11 flights of hurdles and they all get safely over it with brilliant melody on the inside in the lead from Heartbreak Hotel. Heartbreak Hotel though, he's gonna go on over the second, I think, and takes it up by about three quarters of a length to Brilliant Melody on the inside second. That one's gonna cut across now, Heartbreak Hotel, and those two will be disputing the lead, and they're four lengths clear of the chasing pack, who are headed by Cuddly Cord and Pedro Aguirre Churda. The back marker early on is Clifton Hassel as they swing round the left turn and go uphill in the rain this unique track and Heartbreak Hotel is in front. Over to third. And then we'll safely over that one as well. That's the little ambulance. Heartbreak Hotel and Brilliant Minute. Now you can see they're coming past the other end of the straight now with the stand on the other side obviously. So it's round and round the teapot and then shoot up the spouts at the end. So Heartbreak Hotel in the lead then. Brilliant Melody second. And Pedro Aguirre Cheddar in third. In comes Mercury Rising and Cuddly Cord. Cirque is after that one. And then Karma Rouge Island, a woodlass drummer. Hyacinth Calapa as they take the fourth. And two miles still to go. There's also an extremely long run in as well from the final hurdle. Even longer than the uh, running at the Grand National, I think. And Heartbreak Hotel and Brilliant Melody are disputing the lead. They're a good six lengths clear of the grey Pedro Aguirre Cheddar who's in second. Then Mercury Rising on the inside is third. Cuddly Cord is four. Then Woodlass Drummer and Cirque. Karma Rouge Island after that one. And a little bit of a gap. Back to Billy Modern Tapper and Hyacinth Calapa. There we go. Past the other end of the straight again now. We have latent damage just the back marker. And the turn of the Ghost is also surprisingly near the back as well. As they get to the fifth. And they're all slave to the other side of and the heartbreak hotel and brilliant melody have been racing companionably together so far as they get over the sixth good jump by the horse in the green jacket there woodlass drummer has seen that move up sides pedro aguirre chirda for a share of third mercury rising is on the inside fifth and cuddly cord and karma rouge island Clifton Hassel is trying to get a little bit closer circus just dropped back a little bit then hyacinth clapper and billy vodden tapper and a couple of greys, Return of the Ghost and Latent Damage. And finally, Scenario Woodfire is just the back marker. It's just a little more than a mile and a quarter still to go. And they come past the bottom end of the straight again soon. Uh, over that seventh. Bit of a slow jump at the back by Latent Damage. Heartbreak Hotel. And Brilliant Murley. In the lead. about four. The grey horse Pedro Aguirre Cheddar just about in third. Ahead of Woodlass Drummer. Mercury Rising is going well on the rail. One that's trying to creep up close around the outside is the Joshua Sutherland horse return of the ghost. Chopped that one really well and has moved into a more prominent position. He's given up a bit of ground on the outside but will probably try and tuck in shortly. Also making a bit of a forward move after moving out is Graham Clutterbuck's Cuddly Cord. You see they've got a swing left-handed now. They've only got six and a half furlongs to go. And only got three more flights to take. 
and Heartbreak Hotel is in the lead by about half a length to Brilliant Melody as they come past this shoot on the stand for the final time they'll go up it from the other entrance next time and it's Heartbreak Hotel in front from Brilliant Melody in second as they get over to third last the field are now beginning to bunch the leading pair have come back to the pack and Heartbreak Hotel continues to lead from Brilliant Melody Cuddly, Cuddly Cord is going well in third good jump on the outside there by Return of the Ghost who's now in a challenging position Pedro Aguirre Cheddar is still there as well also now running on well is Karma Rouge Island on the inside there um, Brilliant Melody as well Cirque's trying to get into it and Mercury Rising as well but they're racing down towards the final flight then now they've still got two and a half furlongs to go and it's Heartbreak Break Hotel, who is still in the lead, but is now being chased by Cuddly Cord. Return of the Ghost is third with Pedro Aguirre Cheddar and Woodlast Drummer. They come in there towards this final flight. They get over it. They've got to run another furlong and a half. Also trying to run on from the back is Cirque, but it's Heartbreak Hotel in the lead. Heartbreak Hotel from Cuddly Cord in second. Then Return of the Ghost, Woodlast Drummer. After that one, Pedro Aguirre Cheddar. Cirque trying to run on. It's truly between these and now Heartbreak Hotel's got nothing left and Return of the Ghost goes on the flat. Return of the Ghost beginning to pass away as they're finally up the straight and racing up towards the line it's return of the ghost is going to take it from heartbreak hotel <laughs> heartbreak hotel second the cirque stayed on for third pedro aguirre chudo is fourth and then hyacinth calapa after that one so and you pay your money you stand in the stand and you don't see much of the horses but return of the ghost takes it and wins it comfortably in the end really heartbreak hotel second the long time leader and Cirque went on to be third. So Return of the Ghost for Joshua Sutherland wins it. Heartbreak Hotel for Paul Rhodes was second. Cirque for Martin Lillard was third. I think those three will qualify for the final. Maybe Cuddly Cord. Graham Clutterbuck that was fourth gets in as well. And Woodlash Drummer for James Shea was fifth.